What is, that is the craziest thing. Oh my God, you gotta see this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And <laughs> giant Amazon boxes. And you're not gonna believe what I have inside. I'm sure you've heard about Amazon liquidation pallets. They're all over the news. You know, there's even TV shows about this stuff. Maybe you've seen Facebook Marketplace, Amazon return listings, and you say, are those a scam? Is that real? Well, I got news for you. Uh, sometimes it is real. I have, again, 10 boxes here. Uh, and in this video, we're gonna go through, and I, I opened up one to make sure it's not like absolute trash. We're gonna go through the stuff, and I'm gonna show you what's in these boxes. Uh, and at the end of the video, I'll say how much I paid for all this, where you can buy it yourself. Believe it or not, I bought this off of an app. What we're doing is looking for PS5s, Xboxes, laptops, cell phones, watches. And the reason I chose this one is because they do, this is FedEx shipping. So you can live in an apartment complex. You can live somewhere that doesn't allow uh, freight trucks in your subdivision. You can live anywhere and still get this stuff delivered. And that really opens up for anyone to be able to do this. But is it worth your time and money? We're gonna find out. All right, for those of you who don't know, my name is Blake. I like to make money. One of the ways I do that is by buying Amazon return pallets, or in this case, boxes, and selling them online. Here's the rules. We're looking for PS5s, any video games, really. Cell phones, electronics, uh, big, ticket items because you will find them in boxes like this. I've not bought from this particular pallet or box provider, but in previous years, we've done very well and made a lot of money. So without further ado, I'm going to open these up. Everything I open up, you can buy. They're going to go on my eBay store. I'll link below. The way I price things, I'm going on the high end of market price, but if you want it, just send me an offer. Say, hey, Blake, I'm a viewer. Cut me a deal, and I'll cut you a deal because I like you guys being here. And if you like being here, please give it a big thumbs up. That helps me out so much. Small thing for you, big thing for me, and I can keep making fun content just like this. Let's get going. Let's open up our first box. Oh, a big heavy one right here. Very heavy. Let's see, we have any, uh, do I have to take any stickers off with my address on it? Let's open this up and we're gonna say at the end of the video where we got these all from and uh, I'll give you an idea of just how much money I think I'm gonna make. Cause that's kind of the whole deal. It's fun, yes, to see stuff. What do we got here? Oh wow, electronics already. I'm out, I'm out, jeez. What is that? <laughs> oh my gosh, you guys are not going to believe this. So here's the two boxes that I thought were pretty funny. These are vacuums. Rechargeable vacuum cleaner. Two rechargeable vacuum cleaners. Let's open these up. And see just exactly how much of a mess it is. Yeah, they've got void, ceiling void on them. So someone has opened these up. Maybe they put rocks already in here and I'm getting rocks back. I don't think so though. Pretty care. Looks like it was used. Canister vacuum. And then another pretty care. <laughs> Rechargeable vacuum. They kind of look like, you know, I'm, I'll, I'll just say it. They're uh, off-brand Dyson vacuums. But that doesn't mean they're not gonna sell. I mean, these could easily go for that one's a little bit dirtier. Yikes, this is what you run into. So the first one, <laughs> someone just, I don't know if I'm gonna actually sell this. That's pretty nasty. There's some pretty gross hair in there. Uh, I don't like that. The other one was already sealed up. That one, I think it might just go in the trash. Foam, looks like it's um, sheets. Beige King. So for a king size bed, probably, you know, most of these things I think we're gonna be in like the 10 or $20 range. What we're going for is the big home runs, not those, not the little dinkers. 
Woman's October Costume Bavarian. That's the apron. And Oktoberfest is coming up. So, maybe someone will buy it. Women's yoga pants. A gourd? <laughs> I don't know. I mean, these are these are pretty low quality yoga pants. What size are they? Women's large crop pants. Looks like some more pants. A uh, shirt. This is a shirt. Looks like. Does it smell kind of goofy. Smells a little damp. So uh, I'm gonna I'm gonna say this goes in the trash pile <laughs> because that's kind of gross. This is a Walmart return. Walmart online return. Okay. Let's see if Walmart gave us anything good. What the heck. This is part of it, looks like. I could not tell you what this is. The receipt says just that it cost $17. So whatever this was, it cost 17 bucks. And it, did, it came with a hole in the bag. So I'm assuming it gets some sort of clamp? Uh, I don't know. I mean, that's what happens when you do this. Feels like a pair of shoes, maybe? Yeah, shoes. Some sandals. Will someone buy these? What do we have here? Some more clothes. Looks like uh, a sweater pillowcase. I think it's a pillowcase. Okay, it's like a cable knit pillowcase. It's kind of nice. The Brilliant Sound Sound Bar. So a sound bar for like a TV or something. And it looks like it hasn't even been opened. Yeah, it looks like it's still all original. So this might be, the, the, one of the vacuums is trash. This doesn't look like it was ever even installed. But it's still got the original wrapper and everything on it soundbar lp08 that's a test it obviously just i'll tell you right now this box costs or these boxes were 750 bucks and uh so if we can bring back more than 75 dollars per box we're profiting i would say probably that box i mean we're gonna open this last one up but unless this is something really nice probably that box is, is worth less than $75, I would have to say. What do we got here? For a dream. A pillow? I'm not even going to take this out of the bag because there, it's hard to get back in the bag when it's out of the bag. But this will go back in my LD Amazon Mystery Return, uh, you know, cloth items, textiles. And we'll just auction them off because I don't, I don't know enough about... I think that's for like a baby, uh, what do they call What do babies sleep in? <laughs> cradle, a, a, like a cradle uh, fabric thing. On to our next box. Ugh. Okay, what else do we got in here? Let's see, this is where the good stuff's hiding. That first box, kind of a dud. The only two things I'm really gonna be able to sell easily is the one vacuum that's not covered in hair and that sound bar. So I'm guessing probably uh, 50 bucks is what I'll get out of that. All right, again, more packages. We've got some toys. That's always good. We've got a boat. Okay. I guess it was a slow start, but it's, uh, it's speeding up. Some more Walmart returns. Here we go, a boat. Probably 10 or 15 bucks on this, assuming it's all there. Open this up. Yeah, it doesn't look like it was ever used. 
if it was used, usually you'd think you'd see some signs of, of water or moisture. Uh, comes with the user manual, the velocity motorboat. So the way you like a kids game shooting lasers at each other. And yeah, definitely was opened up. Uh, I think that's not the manufacturer package. I don't know actually. Now that I'm looking at it, this might it might just be box damage. A lot of times you're gonna get box damage guns, and yeah, dude, I do not see any evidence that this was used at all. Nice. One, two, three. Looks like a four-person laser tag set came in that box. And how much does a four-person laser tag set go for? I'm guessing 20 to 40 bucks. So, you know, again, we're talking the boat. If the boat works, if the boat works, big if, maybe 15 bucks. You know, again, I got to look at market prices. So I'd say we're, again, probably at the halfway point for that box. And we've got a few more things to open up. I am disappointed with how much clothing there is. Again, more of these cheap sandals. This one has the sandals for women. You know, the wet wedge, ankle buckle, flip-flop sandals. Good keywords to use on, on eBay. You know, I, I'll try and sell them. Hopefully I'll get a couple bucks out of there. Maybe I'll auction them off. I don't know. This looks like it's a women's plus size top three-quarter striped v-neck blouse shirt. I think that's better for like flea markets, to be quite honest. I think there's a lot more people who are saying, hey, that's nice, I'll spend five bucks on that, as opposed to I'll spend 25 bucks when, you know, shipping is taken into account. I'm exaggerating, but you get the point. These look like fake Adidas's. I mean, they, they're not, they, they don't have, they're their own brand. The brand is Say It Relay. S-A-Y-T-R-L-A-E, and I, I actually have seen these sell before on eBay. These are size 41, which is a men's nine and a half. Um, I'm betting you that I get a lot of these shoes. A lot of these shoes in these boxes. That's just how I'm getting that feeling. Here's how they look. So they, that's, you know, not bad. Are they steel-toed? What? Are these the shoes that I see all the... Yeah, these are steel-toed. <laughs> steel-toed uh, shoes. Size nine and a half. Huh. I'm guessing that these go for 20 bucks. I mean, I bet you walk into Walmart, you'd buy a comparable pair for 35 or 40 bucks. So I think online, probably 20 bucks plus shipping. How I would list these. Um... And I'll take any offer I get, you know, above like 10 bucks, basically. Uh, cool, actually, not that bad looking of shoes. Um, socks, too. <laughs> what else do we got? Alrighty, alrighty, let's, uh, let's go about our way, our merry day, and open up someone else's mail. The person says, I asked for gold color, but you send me green color. Green or gold? I think it looks gold. So, you know, once again, dummy customers strike again. And this is like a pillowcase. Here's kind of a funny thing. They, <laughs> they printed off their return label super small. It's a shirt. Large. Like a men's shirt? Nope. We got some more. Probably we're just at about 75 bucks now. So there's four things left that I think will make us profitable, assuming they're worth worth selling. This is a woolen checkered trousers. Two pairs of woolen checkered trousers really cheap like golf pants wow they're big that's a lot bigger than a large what size are they do they say 2xl 2xl yeah so if you want to be john daly for halloween you can you know wear these 
woolen checkered pants. And the next time, you know, this company, uh, who I'll let you know at the end of the video, they do sell other boxes besides returns. They sell electronics, they sell all sorts of stuff. So I think if I buy another one, they actually sent me this, I didn't pay for it. Um, I would say, hey, send me electronics because like this, a skirt for women, you know, some that's gonna work out for someone, but I am not that someone. More for flea markets, garage sales, you know, etc. We have some more now, our third box. Let's check out this bad boy and see what goodies. I'm already seeing goodies. Okay, okay. Another drone. So we'll have to test about these. And then about 15 of these. Nice. Nice, baby. All right. Pan tilt cameras. Now this is where it starts to get good. Works with Alexa, works with Google Assistant. One, two, three, four, five. One fell out. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. 14, yeah, baby. 14 of these security cameras. Like knockoff Nest or Ring or whatever they are. And then some more bags as well. This is also, I don't know what that is. Let me just yank this stuff out of here. Those are definitely shoes. Okay, what the heck is that? You know, 250 bucks. And based on my experience, you know, maybe these are really, really low quality and they go for 125. Uh, but still, we gotta get more boxes like that. We gotta start doing more, more stuff like that uh, because that's where the money is, not in pashminas. Whoa, whoa! Whoa, whoa! Tested, working. This is a pair of shoes I can already tell. Yeah, more size 41. I love how they include socks. That's how you know this is a just a little off note. These, I guarantee you can buy them on Alibaba Express or DH Gate or wherever. And that's why they include these little socks. Because when you're making an Amazon listing, uh, if you include socks, for example, people can't just drop ship. It's your own custom bundle. And I, I hesitate to use that word because of the implications of it all. And then two drones, they were both opened, and I'm assuming crashed into the earth at terminal velocity. And when I pull this out, it's just gonna be a hunk of junk. Oh, it has a nice little case. Okay, okay. So at least it wasn't destroyed in shipping. You know, I'm not even, I don't even know if this has been installed. It doesn't. It doesn't look like it was ever installed, so I'm going to say plausible it will work. And if it does work, this D50 DERC, DRC, DRC, this DRC drone, again, I might just uh, test to make sure it turns on. All the rotors work. I'm probably get 20 or 20 or 30 bucks uh, at a local auction. And I use oftentimes liquid bidding, but I think I might use high bid more. And this is the same thing, you know, just for good measure. Let's see if this one has been opened up yet. Because I really do want you guys to get a good idea of what you're buying if you do buy this. I mean, 750 bucks, there are certainly more expensive things you can buy to resell, uh, but that's not a paltry amount by any, any definition of the word. And this looks like to be similar, maybe? Uh, this one looks like it may have been installed because it's out of the bag. If you like the video, you know, if we can get a thousand thumbs up on this video, 100% do part two, 100% do more pallets from other distributors. Oh, by the way, Latopia, there, that's who it is. Latopia sent me this box. Thank you, Latopia. They are, lo they have locations in 
uh, San Fran or, uh, California and New Jersey. So if anywhere you are in the country, you can order this for 750 bucks from Latopia. They have other ones at 550. Uh, they've got a whole arrangement of things. Go on the app, check it out. They do wholesale. Um, if you can pick up stuff and save on shipping, I think it's a really, really good opportunity. If you're like me having a mail to you, you know, 750, I'm guessing, I, you know, there's seven boxes left, right? Or, or is that how many there were? Six boxes left, seven boxes, including this. I think we're going to make probably about, you know, profit, 500 bucks, I think, based on, you know, I've been doing this for a long time. I get a good feel for things. We could find that PS5 uh, because like these, the ones that are returned in their own packaging, that's not like, like this. I have zero faith in this being good. This, I have a lot of faith it might be a huge, a huge thing. But you don't know until you open it up. Looks like to be a, like a kid's powerboat toy. And then same thing right here. What else do we got? Open and pull out these. This is already opened up, looks like. Oh, like little boogie boards for kids where they go to the beach. This is a anti-dust mite cleaner. That's like an air purifier. Uh, this one goes in its own U-line <laughs> box. And then finally, one more RC car. Skidding stunt car. High speed climbing vehicle. Floral print maxi gown. A costume for a medieval lady. Into the textile bin. No! No! <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's a, <laughs> it's a battery charger. These are still not bad to sell. Is this the battery? Yeah, this is the battery. So a rechargeable battery. Have to get a charger for it, I guess. Um, but these are also, you know, decent local sales. That's what we got. Unfortunately, no PS5s, nothing big. The, the best thing was this, was this 14 Blue Rams A31 security cameras. Those were good. This was good. Um, but I would have liked to see more of those. So, uh, we'll do more of these videos if you guys like them. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe if you're new. And, uh, comment below with what you think of Latopia. Is it a good app? Is it bad? I get ripped off. It was free for me, so I don't feel bad about this. Uh, but would you, would you pay $225? Because that's what it all cost. You know, let's see. One, two, three... Well, there's four of them. So actually, $300. Would you pay 300 bucks for that assortment of stuff? I'd love to hear your opinion on it. And I'll see you guys later.